Welcome to another video edition of YearCast. I'm Kevin Peck, I'm your host, and uh, my guest today is Christian Martorano with another beautiful Nord instrument. This is the Nord Electro 3, and you've been entertaining us here. You've been giving us training, and it really has been going to school. So uh, I'll let you do your, uh, your training, but I'm going to sit back and enjoy every moment of it. Thank you very much. The Nord Electro 3 is a successor to the Nord Electro 2. It features tone wheel modeled organ with all the real-time controls, the drawbar controls, percussion, overdrive, vibrato. It has a classic uh, vintage Vox Continental organ model, and then there's also the Farfisa Italian combo organ model. There's some amp simulators and some great effects. The instrument also features great pianos, some grand pianos, some electric pianos, a digital electric grand, some clavinets, really some beautiful sounds. And then there's some really interesting and what I call boutique sounds from the Mellotron, recorded strings and, and flutes and choir and other really interesting sounds. Let's dig in and we'll first start by looking at the tone wheel organ. They offer a really great thing on the keyboard. It's available in two different lengths. It's available in a 73 note and a 61 note unweighted action both. And the great thing that they give you is that you can play one sound at a time. It's not designed for layering, but on the organ they do give you the ability to split. On many organs you'd have an upper and lower manual. On here you can split the keyboard. So if I were to just play some of the organ sounds, here's one of the tone wheel organ models. And then if I want to split, I can create an upper draw bar setting. This will be brighter with percussion and vibrato. My lower manual would have the duller sound and now I'll put it in split mode. So now I can have really great and just reach up, grab a handful of draw bars anytime you want to be adjusting. I can change the top, the bottom remains the same, I can change the bottom. So it's all really very easy to edit, all live. We're going to look at the Farfisa model now. This uses these drawbar controls as toggle switches now, very similar to the rocker switches found on the original. I'm going to take this out of the rotary organ, um, rotary speaker, and now put it into an amplifier. So we'll just select one of the amp models. And then I'm going to add a little bit of EQ, and I have something now that sounds very reminiscent of the older pop combo organs. So let's listen to the Vox model now. Again, we have draw bar control on the Vox, just like they do on the tone wheel organ model. faithful recreation. I'm going to move off the organs for a moment now and move into the piano section. The piano features um, five different models and these are the grand pianos. We can hear the first one is really nicely laid out for solo piano. It's really great fun to have all the controls on the panel to play with. We'll just run through a few of the electric pianos. There's um, four different Tyne electric pianos, and then there's a Reed electric piano. We'll listen to this one with a little touch of phaser on it for a classic sound. They're a lot of fun. Some of these are very bright, and they give you that kind of nice bark when you dig in. playing these electric piano sounds. I own the originals and these are very faithful recreations. Here's the Reed electric piano. Had a 
got a really nice tremolo setting that you could turn on, and we'll just put trem on here now. A lot of fun. I'll just show a few clavs. The clavinet really made its uh, its biggest appearance with the great American artist Stevie Wonder. And when you start adding effects to these, they get a lot, lot more interesting. Here's a flanger now on a clav, and I'm also going to put a bit of an auto wah effect on it. There's so many. Um, I'm going to move on to the more boutique sounds. These are sounds that came from a vintage tape player called a Mellotron. Here's a very recognizable sound. And of course the Mellotron strings, the very bright, aggressive sound. You have this great control over release. So if I just shift and add some more release, now the sound doesn't immediately cut off. I'm gonna leave it there. There's hours and hours of fun. Many musicians recognize these are the best um, simulated, modeled organs that you can possibly get. Thanks very much for joining us. That was, uh, that was fun, it was great to hear. Had a great time. Thank you for watching.